Hi, my name is Christina Hendricks, and I'm going to tell you a true story of openness. So I have a blog, and it's called uh, You're the Teacher. Uh, and on that blog, sometimes what I do is I take journal articles, and I um, summarize them, mostly for my own note-taking, but also in case anybody else is interested. And then I comment on them. So I'll just say, you know, here's what this journal article says, Here's my comment, and then anybody else who wants to say something can. Um, and I do this partly because the journal articles are behind a paywall, and I'd, I'd like for people who are interested in these issues to be able to also at least hear what the, the articles are about, even if they can't um, read them. Okay, so I have been reading a few articles by someone that I really respect in the education field, and... Um, as I was summarizing a couple of his articles, and I put them on my blog, I got a comment from that person. I mean, this is a person that I think is amazing. He does really wonderful work, and I couldn't believe that he found my blog, and he actually commented on it. That's not all, right? Okay, I mean, that's pretty cool. But I then emailed him because he offered to give a, uh, a copy of um, a new chapter that wasn't published yet to anybody who wanted it. So I emailed him and asked him for that. And I don't remember exactly how it happened, but we ended up getting into a conversation over email about his work. So I was able to ask him questions, to, you know, make comments. Uh, I haven't yet really been able to contribute a lot to um, his own, you know, thinking about this yet, but I'm hoping to as I read more and get more expertise. But it was just amazingly cool that I got to actually connect with this person whose work I'd been reading and that I really respected um, just by posting something on my blog about his work. So I'm really excited about that. I uh, am currently in the country that he lives in, but only here for a year on sabbatical, and, and I'm hoping that I can actually meet him while I'm here, though it's a very large country, and I don't know if I'll actually get to where he is or if he'll get to where I, where I am, but even if that doesn't happen, then at least perhaps in a conference I'll be able to, to talk to him and have coffee or drink or, and you know, be able to chat and have, uh, have even more interaction with this person. So I just think it's, it's the coolest thing that I just did stuff that I thought was for me, um, but it ended up being... I mean, I thought it was just for me, for my own note-taking, and then anybody else who might want to read it, but it ended up being uh, a start of a, of a great um, uh, connection to the person I was writing about. So, great story of openness for me, at least. Thanks.